Hello my friends and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Germany is a clear example of a nation, of a state, of a country that it's just shooting itself in the foot continuously. And not only that it's shooting itself in the foot, but is about to be shot in the head if it continues shooting itself in the foot. Because these weasels that uh, are in control of, not in control, they are the ones who make the decision in the name of the people due to the democratic system of Germany. Uh, these people um, <clears throat> are making certain decisions that hurt the country, the economy, the future. And their decisions are uh, sanctioning Russia, that's shooting yourself in the foot with gas and so on. The second one is providing Ukraine with weapons more and more and more. That is risking Russia getting its sight from someone else or getting another one ready for you. So this is where you're going to be shot right in between your eyes by Russia after you continue shooting yourself in your feet. Now what's going on in, in Deutschland right now? Besides the fact that you guys take uh, less showers and uh, the energy prices skyrocketed because of the sanctions and your moral uh, duty towards, uh, I don't know, uh, towards your guilt that you should not have, but you do have. And by the time you, you do not get rid of that imaginary guilt that you have, I think you need a few palms, I pack pack a few of them to wake you up because you really, really, really are lost. Really, and it's too bad. It's very bad because Germany, the German people are extraordinary people and they are just kept at bay by these weasels who continue to push them down with guilt, guilt, guilt that they should not have. They haven't done anything. So this is an uh, article from the New Voice of Ukraine from September 19th, 2022. Germany faces recession and double-digit inflation, forecasts say. You like that, Germany? You like that? Okay, continue the sanctions and not only. The, the Bundesbank, Germany's, Germany's central bank, forecasts that the German economy will enter a recession and experience inflation in excess of 10%. That could be 19%, could be 20%. News website Politico reported on September 19th, and I'm quoting, there are mounting signs of a recession in the German economy in the sense of a clear, broad-based and prolonged decline in economic output, the report says. That means less jobs, lower wages, uh, lower standards of living. Good job. Keep doing what you're doing and you're going great where you're supposed to go in a very soft landing. All right, so the forecasts, the forecast suggests that German economy will contract for three consecutive quarters well into 2023. And I'm quoting, high inflation and uncertainty with regard to energy supply. You created the uncertainty nobody else does gas how much you want in russia but you don't want to buy it then okay that's good less showers for you more money for gas uh, for energy and lower wages strikes unemployment that's fantastic you just you just ruin your lives that's what you do your country high inflation and uncertainty with regard to energy supply and its costs affect not only the gas and electricity intensive industry and its export business and investments, but also private consumption and the service providers dependent on it, the Bundesbank said. And there's one more thing that right now seems too big to fall under that little umbrella helping you. A lot of private in industries, a lot of private corporations become nationalized. You know what it is? You're not going to own anything and you'll be happy. That's, that's exactly what means. The 
under the pretext that these companies cannot sustain themselves because of the policies implemented and the uh, uh, t t not tariff, but they, the whatever they imposed on uh, you know sanctions on Russia that affect the all in all industry, and instead of going bankrupt, the government jumps in, takes this nationalize them and they become state-owned. Do you understand that? When it's state-owned, the big ones, they're going to be the little ones, the only ones. You're going to have only the ones who sell you ice cream and popsicles. Those will be private, privately owned. The rest, the big ones that you're going to need, the housing market, the energy, the cars, there's going to be private no more. There's going to be state-owned. That is socialism. That's you will not own anything and you will be happy. And who will control that? You? No, they will control it and they will control your lives by doing that. Oh my God, you're in bad shape, people. At the, at the same time, the central bank didn't make exact numerical forecasts of how much the economy will shrink, adding that annualized price inflation in Germany is expected to breach 10% in the coming months. 10%, like a banana republic. I've been to 10%, I've been to 50%, 50%, 5-0. When I was in Romania, it was awful. It was awful. You buy, uh, I don't know, a pair of shoes today, and the same pair of shoes you couldn't buy it in a week or a week and a half because the price was three times the ones that was today, the price you bought you paid for today, but the income would not go. So the, the prices would go like this quickly, and this is the income, this is the prices. That's how it goes. This is a price of goods like this, fast, and this is your income. Barely moving, so you could buy less, less, and less. You're gonna be a tragedy, you see it. You see it. The millionaires will still have the money and property and everything, so they will have, it's like a, a fat person. A fat person has a lot of fat. To his body can eat it if it's hungry. But if you're sneak, uh, skinny, what's, what's going to eat? You're fat. You don't have anything. You're going to eat your muscles, fibers, and whatever. And then you're going to be what? Quick. Go to bed. Anyway, it's not like that. Um, uh, that's why the, uh, our bodies in the winter seem uh, always gain weight. is because uh, the bodies body whenever it feels cold knows that uh, you know it's going to be trouble so it tries to accumulate as much uh, uh, fat so it has not only for the cold but also for internal use of uh, calories because you burn those fat and whatever you got turns into calories and um, that you can burn and, and so on in caloric uh, and energy and so on so it's just um you, you're just going to be in a, in a bad shape. Not only you, the United States is going to be, but the uh, United States is going to come after. But it's unbelievable how they shot themselves in their feet. And now they, they're going to send, uh, uh, they're going to send weapons, all kind of weapons to uh, Ukraine, tanks, and the Russians already said, you guys are crossing the red line. Now, what's going to happen? When you cross a, a red line, gonna be rockets coming? What kind of rockets? Anyway, thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.